All right, million dollar picks. Round two, we won $709,000 last week. If you include last year's playoffs, we are up $5.36 million in five playoff rounds. Pretty good. Schrager. Not bad. We Pretty really good. liked this week. In fact, we liked it so much, we had trouble figuring out what bets we were going to make and how to make them and do the whole thing. Tennessee is favored by minus three and a half over the Bengals. What are we worried about in this game, Shregs? We, we, we're worried about Cincinnati just having Joe Burrow being this magician and being able to go on one of these great runs as a quarterback and saying, Allen, Mahomes, get out of the way. That's all I'm worried about. Otherwise, I love Tennessee in this one. And we're worried about the backdoor cover. That was supposed to be your first answer. Sorry. Yeah, we think Burrow is like in that Josh Allen when he tasted the playoffs for the first time, kind of crossed with Josh Allen last year. He's somewhere in between those two things. A little worried about it going against them, but love this Tennessee team. Love the nobody believes in us factor. Derrick Henry coming back. Resilient team. They're home. Nobody thinks they should even be the one seed. No. Perfect. We'll take them. Perfect. We're going to bet $400,000 on the Tennessee Titans. Minus three and a half. We're going to bet $200,000 on the San Francisco 49ers. Hey now. Plus five and a half in Green Bay. We laid out the case. I think this is the best team in the NFC. I think they can win the game outright. If they don't, I think it's a tight game. Packers, worst special teams, not only in the playoffs, in the league. They were 32nd, 22nd defense. They got some guys coming back. But in general, this is the perfect type of team to beat the Packers in cold weather in Lambeau. Do you agree? Yes, Kyle Shanahan has these guys dialed in. He has also worked with all of the coaches in Green Bay, knows Joe Barry's defense inside and out. And when they get Debo Samuel going, everyone knows it's going to him, and yet the whole entire offense commits to creating those opportunities. When they played in week three, Debo Samuel did nothing out of the running back spot. I think he's going to do a whole bunch, and good luck stopping it. No one else has. We're going to have a prop with this because we also like Elijah Mitchell in this game because he's shown some size as well. All right, 100K on the following bets. Chiefs, minus one and a half. It's a, it's a the pick Buffalo to me. Bills. Let's go. We think this line should be Chiefs by three. We love that the Bills are the everybody believes in us team from last round, that everybody has Josh Allen headed to the uh, to the all-time quarterback Hall of Fame, including myself. I did it with Sal. It's like, who would you rather have, Mahomes or Allen? I think I'd rather have Josh Allen. Mahomes hears all of this. Oh, yeah. Mahomes has his, he has his spies, he has his ears. He's like, oh, oh, Josh Allen's the guy? I'm not the guy anymore? I'm out? What did I do? All I did was I made the Super Bowl twice. I won one of them. I made the AFC title game. Got screwed over by D Ford. I would have made it that year too. I'm out. I'm out. I'm Pat Mahomes. <laughs> I'm out. Who's this guy? Anyway, we like the Chiefs. We love Jet McKinnon. Oh. We like his work. We enjoy him. Um, in general, Chiefs minus one and a half. It's a dog fight. We like having the home team. And again, it's really hard for road teams to win. Last 10 years, not nine of the last 40, we've seen the road team win. So yeah. it, that cannot be slept on in round two. It's very hard for the road team to win. If this game was in Buffalo, I might go a different way. I just don't think Mahomes, Hill, Kelsey, Andy Reid, and those guys are ready to just give that torch to Josh Allen and the Bills just yet. I'll add in. It, it, last week was a masterpiece from the Bills. It was the greatest offensive performance we've seen from that team. Brian Dable put it on national television. Can you replicate that? You might have to against this team. And lastly, to your point with Mahomes, Allen goes out there, throws five touchdowns, runs for 70 yards, perfect game. Sunday night, Mahomes throws for 400 yards, five touchdowns, mm. hold my beer. I, I don't think he's ready to go quietly into the night and just be a part of the Josh Allen story just yet. It's a hold my beer game for Pat Mahomes. I like it. All right. We're putting 100K on the uh, the Chiefs minus one and a half. And on the Rams plus three, we feel like this is a field goal game. There's a lot of signs that we talked about earlier in the pod with the Bucks that things just a little off. Doesn't all feel over right. the place. Doesn't feel right. Doesn't feel right with the Brady and the receivers with some guys out. A lot of pressure on Grok in this game. Can Mike Evans play four quarters in a row? Can Leonard Fournette do anything? They didn't want to play him last week. Had some sort of hammy issue. What happens if he's not out there? Who is Brady's check down guy if the Rams pass rush is all over? Cooper Cup, Odell got going last week. I don't even love this Rams team, but I think they have a, as much of a chance to win as the Bucs do. So we're going to grab the plus three. 
stop the run, send those dogs, Von Miller, Leonard Floyd, and then drop back seven. And if Brady can dissect that defense with big plays from Terrell Johnson and uh, Scotty Miller and Brett and Brashard Perryman, then God bless them. They did it. I, I don't know. I, I like the Rams in this one. And I, I just, I look at a lot of the different things with Werfs and with Jensen. And if they're not at a hundred percent, Aaron Donald and Von Miller and Leonard Floyd and Greg Gaines can give them hell. Some props. We're going to put a uh, hundred K on the Niners money line plus 200 with the Titans to win. That is plus 366. 100K, you good? We go 75K if you want. Go 75K. I like All the right, Niners we'll with the points, but I don't want to put too much on the win, but I like it with the points for sure. All right. So we'll do, and maybe we'll just put 50K in that because okay. I had 50K, 50K in the other ones. All right. We'll put a little 50K in that one. Now, you know what? You know what? Do your you know thing. what? 75K. I'm feeling it. 75K. Niners win, Titans win, plus 366. I wonder if FanDuel will boost that for us. We'll, we'll find out this weekend because we're going to boost at least one of these on FanDuel. I have another 50K with the Niners. Adjusted line, plus seven and a half with I the like Rams. That. Adjusted line, plus four and a half. That is plus 170. We're going to put 50K on that. We're also going to put 50K on Titans. Adjusted line, minus nine and a half. A.J. Brown will score a TD. A.J. Brown will have 75 yards or more rushing. That is plus 829. Receiving, A.J. Brown, right? Yeah, receiving. Okay, yeah. I'm in. Receiving. 50K or 33K in that? Let's go 50K. Let's, Let's go win 50K. a lot of money on that Titans game. And then we have two small ones that we're going to do um, for 33K. I'm going to give you a choice. Okay. <laughs> Rams defensive touchdown at Ooh. any point in the game with Rams plus three and a half slightly adjusted is plus 969. Okay. Rams defense scores the first touchdown of the game. Rams win is plus 56 54. Let's do that one. Let's go. You want to go? So, Rams, sure. all right, you know what? Wait, you want to put 10K on that? Yeah, 10K. That could settle the entire season for us on million dollar picks. We're good. Let's just kick back and enjoy the, 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 the who's, who's going to score it? Call out who's going to score it. Is it Ramsey? Who do you it want? It feels like strip sack, like Leonard Floyd okay. bringing it in. Is it Eric Weddle going to the house of the pick six? <laughs> Eric, Eric Weddle's cheering it on. 10K in that, and then 33K in the following parlay. It's the same game parlay, which I, I'm trying to get FanDuel to boost this. You know what? We'll boost it right now. We're going to boost it from plus 886 to plus 950. Okay. And maybe they'll even be more generous than that, but we're boosting it for the pot. Elijah Mitchell will have 60 plus rushing yards. Okay. Debo Samuel will have 25 plus rushing yards. Juwan Jennings will score a TD at some point in the game. Number 15, let's go. Niners plus seven and a half alternate spread. That is plus 950. We're boosting it to. We're going to put 33K on that as well. And those are. Those are. Any, anything? What did we miss? Anything? Nothing. Jawan Jennings scoring a touchdown. Let's go. Jawan Jennings. We got Rams defense. Little A.J. Brown. Debo Samuel. We have, we'll have some heroes. Weekend. And Pat Mahomes. Just remember, people including myself said, hey, I might take Josh Allen over you. Just keep that. Keep that pulse in your brain. Those are the million dollar picks for round two. Peter Schrager. Pleasure as always. Let's go. Let's go. 